this is an interesting ecosystem. This is basically the oak chuskia ecosystem. And as opposed to the cloud forest, I mean, some people will consider this a cloud forest because it still has quite a lot of um, clouds and condensa condensation. It is a little bit above the cloud forest, so still has a lot of amplified some trees, but the diversity drops compared, compared to say like the um, Monterey Cloud Forest, which is um, right now not considered a lot a cloud forest unless you're really high up due to global warming, but what used to be the Monterey Cloud Forest. And um, so the highlands are just a very, very interesting ecosystem. I always, I found it, I always find it fascinating because it, it reminds me of uh, the stories of Tolkien and, the, and that the elves, and I always want to think that there's an elf that's about to show up from the mushrooms of the highland forests that you see there. And they have um, capsules which are mostly found in highland forests, in cut forests, and uh, there's a lot of endemism in this area. If you would include the Chiriqui and Boca del Toro highlands, Costa Rica I think would have about, I think the number is like 50 or 54 species of endemic animals and plants.